Alawa versus Sterling. Betfred Cup match day four. Sterling, after only really losing to Hibs or penalties on the opening day, have been turned over mercilessly by our Arbroath and then Elgin City. While Alaba's penalty defeat to Elgin and narrow 2 0 loss at Easter Road has left them with slim hope of finishing runners up in the group. Peter Grant's third game in charge sees a third change in lineup and this time a change in formation. Two up front with Buchanan returning in place of Troughton and summer signing Andy Stirling starts in midfield ahead of Adam Brown. Parry's 93 game run between the sticks ends after injury at Hibs. But Chris Henry makes his first competitive start. It's been 10 years since Sterling last won this fixture and they'll not want to end with the Group C wooden spoon. They make five changes to the side that were turned over at Elgin. Hawk, Binney, Jardin, Thompson and McGeeke all taking starting berths. Both sides in their traditional colours. Sterling to get us underway. Taking corner by Alawa. Flanagan puts the ball in, headed at the front post, but on to Liam Buchanan, who really should have scored. Open goal. Could only put it straight to Binney. Graham. Inside to Andy Sterling. Playing centre midfield today. Wide to Flanagan. Goes inside, right foot, he chipped ball through to Liam Buchanan. Flicks it over the defender, could get a shot away. Sadly, he drags it wide though. Some goal. Ball launch forward by Loudon. Andy Graham is holding off the challenge, but he does give the ball away on the edge. Jardin goes for goal. Easy take for Chris Henry in the Alawa goal. Still in free kick. Swung in, and it's McLean who gets his head to it. Just flicks it narrowly wide of the goal. Flanagan, Sterling. Great little one two between him and Hetherington. Hetherington then strikes for goal. Trundles wide. Sterling launches the ball forward. Andy Graham against Cammy Thompson. Sterling will get that ball into the box. Tiger doesn't get rid of it. And Henry quick to smother any danger. Coley, great work from him. It is robbed eventually by Loudon. Who goes for goal. A couple yards over. Would have been a spectacular effort. Tagger launches the ball long. Looking for O'Hara. Headed away though, only as far as Flanagan who plays the ball forward to Buchanan. He can only put his shot over the bar though. Now, throw in Alawa, Flanagan to Sterling. Back to Dick. Swings the ball in. Flick on by O'Hara. Buchanan can't get on the end of it. A break for O'Hara. Goes for goal. That can only hit the keeper's body. Free kick, David Wilson to step up. He puts it in the top corner. In off the bar. And just like last week when Alwa played Elgin City, the opener comes from a sublime free kick from the visitors. <laughs> Flanagan's turn to try his luck. Just curls it over. Stevie Hetherington launches it for Andy Graham. Can head it towards goal. Easy take for Burry though. Graham to Hetherington. Easy option wide to Liam Dick. Played inside to Alan Troughton. Hara. Robertson. Alan working their way patiently. Left to right, right to left. Now with Kevin Cawley, he goes from range, just balloons it over the bar though. Flanagan to Hetherington, all played across the Tiger, who carries it deep into the still in half, the centre back, inside to Cawley, and Trout in, 
goes with a low drive. It's going bottom corner, but not enough power to beat the Stirling keeper. Moving off loud in. It's the ball into the middle. O'Hara puts Alo a level. It's first goal for the Wasps. Just his second start. Missing out the tackle. Troughton catches his man late. Still in breaking with Jardin. Cameron Thompson goes for goal. It's going top corner. Good save by Chris Henry. Flanagan dinks the ball forward. In search of O'Hara. Comes down to Robertson. O'Hara goes inside. Left foot shot. Coming into the centre of the goal. Easy for Benny. Robertson throws it into Troughton and has received the ball back. 1 2. Robertson to Ahara. Try his shot twice, he's blocked. And the Collie blocked on that shot as well. And Benny collects. Stevie Hetherington to put in the deep cross. Aimed for Andy Graham. Flip towards goal. Liam Buchanan. And headed into the back of the net. He should have scored one in the first half. He makes no mistake at the death. It's his second goal of the group stages. Hetherington. His pass just too far for Kevin Colley. Wade is still in advance down the right hand side. Ball played in, in the middle. Willis strikes first time. Stalin running out of time. 